YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys. Welcome back to the channel. I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that'll encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. Today is $20 Tuesday. And on $20 Tuesday, I share super cute hair and fashion finds for the lovely $20 price range and below. I know y'all saw the title. We're here with an Amazon dress haul. It is the fall season. And I want to bring some new finds for you all. It's been a minute since I've done some fashion on the channel. I've actually been doing a lot of fashion finds on my TikTok. Is that your hair? Same name. Definitely check out my TikTok. You'll see a lot of different type of content there. And y'all, we've had a little growth spurt recently. We're at 20K on TikTok now. I'm excited. I actually plan on doing a nice little giveaway to celebrate that milestone. So make sure you're subscribed to my channel. Turn those notifications on so that you will be reminded of what's going on over here. And to all of you that have actually come over to my TikTok to say, hey, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Now, if you're interested in the hair that I'm wearing, I showcase this hair two $20 Tuesdays ago. It's a half wig. It's by Sensational. Y'all see the wig, right? Like it's absolutely gorgeous. But now it's a little bit shorter because I did cut it because I just I just wanted a shorter look and I, I still really love it. Got it flipped over. I got my little headband on. We chilling over here, okay? <laughs> I actually look like I'm about to go out on a date. Like, what? Mm, hold on. Y'all not ready? I cannot wait to show y'all the dresses from this haul, including this one that I have on right now. It, it has me looking so right. Now, if this haul helps you, make sure you share this video with a friend. Make sure you drop me a comment and let me know. And also, look out for my next Amazon haul that will be dropping in the next two weeks or so. It's going to be a bigger haul, more pieces, more outfits to showcase, not just dresses. I also have boots and outerwear, including that haul. It's going to be good. Can't wait to share that with y'all. All right, so let's just dive right in, shall we? <laughs> let's get into some items that I'm really loving right now that are under $30. Yes, y'all, I'm talking like $19, $25, $28. I'm finding some really good stuff on Amazon. And make sure you're following my Amazon storefront because I actually go live on that platform, on the Amazon platform, I'm trying to be more consistent with it, but ideally I would like to do it on a bi-weekly basis. We have such a good time when I go live and I get to try on things in real time or try different beauty products. It's great, so follow me on there. We're gonna start with the cheapest dress I have ever found on Amazon. I cannot believe this price. This dress is only $6.99. And it's not just in one color. I believe it's in the red color and another color is $6.99. Now in the black, it'll be $9.99, but just look at the dress. This is a $6.99 dress from Amazon. <laughs> what do y'all think? Let me know. I feel like a dress like this is normally priced at like $25 on Amazon, maybe $30 because of the, the style of the dress. This is giving body. This is giving... <laughs> This is a, definitely a very bold piece, especially when you look at the back. You see how those cutouts go all the way up to the back? I think that's so unique and also very sexy at the same time. My only qualm with this dress is that there, like, the gaping is a little bit interesting towards the bottom. It makes me feel like I need to size down to a small when I really normally just wear mediums. And I'm just like, I don't know if sizing down will help or not. But either way, for the price, you cannot tell me anything in that dress. Even for $19.99, I still think it's worth it to get it in the black color. If you plan on getting this in black or red, comment down below. But I got the purple because I was like, you know what? I'm not here for just wearing blacks and burgundies in the winter time. I, I still like wearing color all year round and I wanna encourage you to do the same. And as far as the style, I mean, I've been on this cutout phase lately. Like lately I just wanna show different parts of my body in a unique way. So this dress definitely aligns with that. I noticed though, however, like on my TikTok account when I showcased one of my cutout dresses, people loved it. But I received certain comments saying, like, I'm just not confident enough to wear it. You know, there's no way I can pull that off. And I just really, when y'all come here and watch my fashion hauls, y'all, this is a safe space. And I want you to see that it's okay to have a curvy body, you know, be a little thick and wear bold, risque pieces. Growing up, me wearing these type of pieces obviously was not allowed, but once I was an adult, it was as if I was supposed to shy away from it because of my body type, because I wasn't considered like 
super super skinny if that's your type of thinking i really want you to eradicate that it's okay to be full figured and wear short skirts it's okay to have double d's and have your titties out it's okay <laughs> i'm really here for women just loving the fuck out of their bodies, doing what they want as they wish, as they please. So if you like to show off different parts of your body, that's fine. If you like to be more modest, that's fine too, as long as you are actually wearing what you wanna wear and not worrying about what other people are, are thinking of you. I know this went off on a tangent, but I really just had to let that be known because I've been receiving a lot of comments on TikTok where people are just not feeling confident within their bodies and i just feel like we only get one right we only get one we really got to make the best of it and really figure out ways to love it as is and if you want to change it that's cool but i still want us to love ourselves through the process okay next dress i have here is this beautiful holiday red satin dress i actually sized up in this because sometimes with satin if it's not like a stretchy type of satin it's gonna go all wrong and my ass is gonna be out <laughs> we can't have that so i got an extra large in this and i actually really like the way this fits i already tried this on it, it looks good this is the dress and i feel super comfortable in it i'm so glad that i sized up be mindful my measurements are 38d 34 waist and a 44 hip and I think that this covers those measurements perfectly I really don't have much complaints about the dress except I probably still can't really bend all the way down in it but that's okay and for the price y'all this was $13.99 on Amazon where am I finding these dresses for under $15 like this is not happening to me last holiday season I wasn't finding these crazy deals I don't know maybe I'm just looking out this year and if you're watching this you're about to hit the jackpot because I when I tell you I have so many good finds oh child I can't this is just the tip of the iceberg but yes I like this dress it feels good on the skin I just love satin I have like I have like eight satin dresses total and this is my technically this is my second long sleeve one the first long sleeve one I got was a dub I never showed y'all that and I, I I just won't It looked like a trash bag on me but this one I think it hugs my curves perfectly so the next dress I'm gonna show y'all is the one that I'm wearing this has to be my favorite Amazon dress that I've purchased this year one of my favorites at least my favorite one that is under $30. This dress only costs $19.99, y'all, and I have it in two colors. I have it in this lovely black color, and I have it in this gorgeous brown. What? Ah! This is like the perfect muted brown for me. I think it looks really good on my skin tone. Oh, chef's kiss. I wore this out to a brunch event, and I received nonstop compliments. I absolutely love this dress. Now, I tried this dress in a large. It was feeling super uncomfortable. Extra large, when I tell you this thing is like, whew, like y'all sell me, right? Like this is skin tight in the XL. So I would say that this runs kind of small. If you have my measurements, please just do yourself a favor and get the XL. If your waist is smaller than mine, like if you're like a 30 waist and below, you can probably get away with like a large or something lower than that. But if you got a, a, a chunkier waist like me, get the XL. But it looks so damn good i feel so damn good and that's the point of me doing these hauls i'm trying to find pieces that will accentuate your curves and also have you feeling super confident when you step out of your home especially once you got your little hair done you got a little lash a little blush on <laughs> you can't tell me nothing the way i feel in this little number is how we should all feel when we walk outside every single day okay so this is another dress that i got in both the black and brown color I originally started with the black and what attracted me to this dress was someone on Instagram actually had it right and I was like oh that's that's really nice look at this it has the mesh all the way down here at the sides and it's solid in the front I'm not a fan of these rhinestones right here to me the rhinestones kind of cheapen the look of the dress but because I think the dress is so cute I'm willing to kind of take it with it and i also got it in the brown color so let me show you what it looks like now i'm wearing the black in a size large and i realized that was too large i needed a, a medium this dress has so much stretch and that's how it is for me with bodycon dresses i normally just go for a straight medium unless it's shorter than my knee like if it's like two inches shorter than my knee i will size up to a large just so that my booty isn't like falling out of it but i really like the way this looks especially in the black i think it's a very sexy number 
it's giving date night vibes it's even giving like maybe like a little birthday switch out like if you want your second outfit this could be your second birthday outfit this is also the type of dress that i would bring with me on vacation i know this is supposed to be like a fall haul but the thing about me is i wear my summer clothes in the winter <laughs> jacket and then I'm like good to go I know y'all noticed the um, jacket that I wore with the leather and that jacket I guess I'll just show it to y'all real quick this black jacket that I bought to black denim this is my first black denim jacket and it's all thanks to my boo thing Liz Tool my fashion bestie love her she had this on and I had to get it I've worn it several times already and it's it's oh I love it it's an oversized jacket I got this one in a size small and I really really like the way it fits as a small I also have a blue denim one let me show y'all that too and this blue denim one I actually got this one in a what a medium and to me it was fitting like bigger than i would have liked but i still love it <laughs> the more i wear it the more i fall in love with it when it comes to oversized clothing it's a matter of preference so i can't really guide you as far as what you should buy but just know if you like it on me buy the size that i got if you're my similar size okay y'all i have another leather dress for y'all i bought this dress wow like months ago was that last year or maybe earlier this year i have this in a size large it's this beautiful brown cognac color and then you'll see on the inside here the inside this is what it looks like and it has a zipper closure in the back that goes pretty much what i think it goes to the right here to the center of the dress it was a little bit hard for me to put on like i remember the first time i put this on i had to have c help me you could do something where you turn this around zip it up in the front and then turn it back around if you have help it'll be great if you don't have help it might be a struggle again i have a thicker waist so i don't know i feel like if my waist was smaller it probably would go up a little bit easier but either way i'm loving the dress this is what it looks like on me just just know that when it comes to the fall winter season i'm a sucker for leather and i love this leather mini dress there are other colors available they added colors the first time i bought this they only had this in like what four colors but if you look here they have what they have like three different types of blues they have purple like a lavender they have red now oh my goodness this is a great item to have in your closet I haven't worn this out yet so I cannot even speak to like the longevity because you know how with certain type of PU leather sometimes it might start fraying in certain areas I don't know I'm not really too worried about it because one it was only $28 two this is not an item of clothing that I'm gonna be wearing frequently so what I can tell right now I, I, I anticipate it holding up for a while I do I also like that with the shape of this leather dress the hips come out a little bit which shows me it's at least trying to accommodate curvy women which i always appreciate because sometimes they be trying to leave us curvy girls out and i'll appreciate that <laughs> also i know some of you that watch me wear plus sizes please go look at my storefront y'all i have an entire section and it's called plus size fashion inspo where i add on a weekly basis different items that are available in plus sizes that i would wear if i wore plus sizes like it's part of my fashion taste so i put it in my storefront just in case you want to take a look around and you think that it looks cute too some of you commented that you really appreciate the fact that i linked that in my other amazon videos so i just want to announce it again in case you're new here check that out my amazon storefront is very lit y'all <laughs> In case you haven't noticed, I think I do a very good job at keeping it together. And I really appreciate y'all that shopped at my storefront. Y'all have no idea. It makes such a huge difference. And I cannot thank y'all enough. Okay, so this next dress is a simple, you know, basic black dress. But what I love about it, it has this zip down feature here. And it also has keyholes. This is what it looks like on me. If you haven't noticed, I like having my girls out. <laughs> So the fact that I can just zip this bad boy down and have them peeking out a little bit really makes me happy. This is such a flattering item. It's black. You can't go wrong with wearing black. I would wear this with like my Fila sneakers. I would probably toss on my Telfar bag. Maybe grab one of my denim jackets and I would head out the door. And I really appreciate the material. It's like a stretchy, almost like spandex type of material, which I love. Oh my goodness. I love that. Sometimes these type of dresses can be 
just strictly cotton which i'm not always a fan of i really like when it's a spandex type of material and it's super stretchy of course what size did i get this in i got this in a pretty sure i got this in a medium mm, i can't tell i can't see <laughs> But y'all know that in the description box, everything is linked there. And I also include the sizes that I bought. All the info's there. But of course, if I miss anything or if you have a question, don't be shy. Drop me a comment. All right, this next dress right here, this is actually a two-piece set. I have talked about this set endlessly during the summer. I had it in like four colors. This one I bought last winter, I believe. So I have it as a two-piece set and I also have it as like a full dress. So if you don't want to like expose your stomach, the full dress option is also available. I'll link it. But I just love this. I think it looks so good on. It's so flattering. Super, super stretchy. Now I will say the fabric isn't the most forgiving. So if you do have like a little pouch that you may not want to be as visible, you might want to go with a darker color. Otherwise, you know, your pouch is going to show. Unless you decide to wear shapewear. But I love this. I love this. And I like the way my girl's looking. Now, I've tried this set in three different sizes. Small, medium, and large. Large was definitely like giving comfort. <laughs> giving like this is what I want to wear in the house. The medium to me is like my perfect fit. And then the small was if I really wanted something. Shoosh, you know what I mean? Like super tight, super form fitting. If that's the look I'm going for, cool. Also, I noticed my stomach was poking out more when I wore the small which I wasn't really liking that look too much. So I think medium is my best bet. But I think this is, ugh, I just love this rib knit material. Uh, give this to me in multiple styles, Amazon, please. I love it. And if y'all want to know the bra that I'm wearing, I've talked about this bra before. I actually have an Amazon video where I um, showcase different bralettes that I really love. This is my favorite push-up bra. So if you need a push-up bra like an everyday one grab this black bra y'all grab it i'm gonna talk about it again at some point but just just add it to the cart now because i cannot stop wearing it <laughs> it makes my girls look amazing absolutely amazing okay so this next dress had no reviews on amazon but it looked good on the model so i decided to take a risk and this is what it looks like this uh, it feels so good on y'all definitely a very deep v so you can wear like a deep v bra which i will link in my description box you can also use booby tape i have some booby tape that i really need to do a tiktok video on but either way when i do it y'all will know but i tried my best with the deep v bra to at least show you give you an idea of what it could look like and I absolutely love it. You might have noticed by now, but I'm a big fan of brown in the winter time, especially this type of rich cognac kind of brown. Ugh, it's to die for. And I also really love floor length maxi dresses. That's a year round thing for me. So this is no different. I would totally get this in two more colors. Another rib knit material. And of course, I like that these are definitely accommodating the hips ladies i got this in a size medium which is my you know normal go-to when it's like stretchy bodycon could i have sized down i feel like i could have but again i don't you know i'm at a phase now where i don't want everything to be super tight like when i was younger i wanted my jeans tight i wanted my shirt tight i also was a lot smaller <laughs> But I just wanted everything like super, super, sh 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 you know. Now, I still like form-fitting things, but I can appreciate dresses that are a little bit, you know, still show off my curves, but they're not like clinging to my skin all the time. Does that make sense? You feel what I'm saying? If you feel me, comment down below. Okay, so this next dress, I, this is not my favorite, but I'm going to show y'all anyway. <laughs> um i like the idea of it because it came with these sleeves here you see these sleeves do these have keyholes uh yes these sleeves have keyholes let me show you what it looks like so it's a you know a pretty simple black dress that you could probably go out with maybe for a happy hour or something i'm just not a fan of this chain detail i, I could do without that i, I really just yeah not really a fan of that i really just want the sleeves <laughs> is that bad i am probably not gonna end up wearing this dress 
but I will definitely find a reason to wear these black sleeves with a keyhole with something. I don't know. But it's stretchy, it's cute, and it's cheap. So I figured, hey, may as well show it. So I know Tuesday, somebody might like it. This rib knit dress I also have in a royal blue color. I never got to show y'all that on the channel, the two-piece. But here's the thing, if you're transitioning into fall, you can always throw on a jacket. That's why I got these denim jackets to make my summer pieces transition well, and I think it looks very cute. Royal blue is not a color that I wear often, but I do consider it a power color, and I just love the way it looks on dark skin. My goodness, it looks so freaking good. All right, y'all, this is the last dress for today. I actually just ordered this, what, like last week, and I got it, and I like it. It's really giving, the material is giving more like summer vacation vibes. But I'm sure some of y'all will be vacationing soon, maybe for the holidays, you never know. I love the material, the way it feels on me. I like the stretch. I'm wearing a size medium. And the only reason why I didn't size down further, but and the only reason why I didn't size down, knowing how stretchy it is, because I was worried that there would be gaping by the buttonholes. I think with the medium, I'm safe. And I love that it touches the floor. I'm 5'3". So, you know, I like a good floor length situation if I could find one. But it's not that hard when you're short, but at the same time, sometimes I notice some of these dresses are too long for a short girl. So, this is a good length for me. And of course, I like that it can unbutton and show off my girls a little bit too. The only thing I don't like about this dress is the fact that it's white on the inside. Ugh. I do not like when clothing is like this. Like, what? uh it just looks so cheap to me <laughs> i don't like it at all but i still want to keep this because i like the pattern i like i'm not a big purple fan but the purple is cute they, they also have this available in green and blue the green is really calling me especially for like a vacation vibe let me know what you think and of course it's under 30 dollars why not? So yes, y'all, these are all the dresses I have for you today under $30. Let me know what your thoughts are. Which ones are your favorite? Are you adding any of these to the cart? Definitely take my advice as far as transitioning into fall. You can always grab a nice blazer or a cropped jacket in order to ease it in to the cooler months. Overall, I'm really pleased with the pieces that I bought and I cannot wait to show y'all my full more extensive haul in the next two weeks now remember this is not my first amazon haul y'all i've been talking about amazon fashion for probably like a good two years now it's just that i've become more frequent with it within the past year and i have way more to share please follow me on tiktok if you want to see certain items first because tiktok just it's just easier for me to get content out on there because i'm just like talking to my phone and i just show things as i get them so make sure you hit up is that your hair on tiktok if you don't want to wait for full review also i will be going live on amazon very soon by next week by which is the first week of november and we're aiming for bi-weekly i will make sure i notify y'all in my community tab on youtube so please pay attention to that or just have your notifications on or if you just want to know slide into my dms on instagram or comment on this video and i'll be sure to update you now if you're new here and you like what you see consider subscribing join the family right now we're on the road to 40k and i'm super super excited the holidays are damn near here <laughs> and i have a lot of things to show you all thank you so much for supporting my amazon storefront supporting all of my amazon content it means the world to me like i can't even y'all don't even know i'm actually coming out with an amazon favorites video which is a long time coming like favorites for beauty fashion tech home it's gonna be a pretty robust video and i'm pretty sure that's gonna be the giveaway video for my tiktok videos going viral so you don't want to miss that make sure you tune in and if you want to see some of my latest videos check them out over here to the right of me thank y'all so much for rocking with me for joining me on twenty dollar tuesday premiere party i love y'all and i will see you in the next video bye